What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Zero the Gold Cap Challenge. This is a working man's gold farm, and today we'll be cleaning out the auction house. Uh, it's been a couple weeks since I've done this. Uh, I've taken a little time away from the game. Work's been kind of busy, and I don't know. With the release of Classic and Retail, I just kind of got overwhelmed with things and didn't really know what I wanted to play, and just kind of lost my way for a little bit there. But I think I'm, I think I'm back trying to just farm gold uh, I think I'm kind of giving up on classic a little bit so I'm um, definitely going to be back farming gold I uh, worked on my professions this week and I'm going to keep working on that and keep building up my auction house uh, when I came back earlier this week I had like less than 500 auctions I think about 450 auctions so I got that working back up to about 650 right now so I'm going to keep working on that and go over and see from there uh, definitely want to start doing some runs again. I haven't done a good run in a while. Uh, maybe still with this, or maybe I'll just try and solo uh, Salt Stone Cave or something like that. Um, I've been farming the Battered Hill. I got one of those the other day, so I put that in the auction house. And now I'm working on the Sealed Tome of the Lost Legion. I'm trying to farm that up. And then from there, uh, I'm thinking maybe like a Bronze Whelpling or something like that, just to put that in the auction house too. Uh, maybe get some fill things. I know they're really cheap, but they're super easy to get. And maybe that'll be some steady sales for me. And uh, all right, let's get into the videos here. Let's get into the what we're here for. Uh, let's see. First 50 auctions is 104,742. Uh, we sold 134 auctions, and that's probably within about two weeks or three weeks. But again, I honestly didn't really start posting anything until probably the last two days now so maybe three days i've had many a day where many a week where i just haven't even posted so um definitely want to get back into it so like i said so let's see what we sold here uh thundering skyfire diamond design 19,000 gold design for jagged talisite 3,000 gold truck shiv 1900 gold jousters girdle 3,800 gold uh, enchant chest versatility for 4500 uh, let's see tome of illusion cataclysm 5000 uh, wolf riders legs 1900 uh, tome of illusion pandera 1700 enchant weapon power torrent 2200 um, let's see. Yeah, this is where it gets kind of crazy because I noticed this the other day. It makes me laugh because it's insane. Uh, gigantic bag. I've done a video on that. You buy it for 2,500 gold. I just sold it for 15,800. But this is the craziest part. If you look right here, three wine glasses. You buy them for, I think, 11 fucking copper. And I sold three of them for 5,327 gold. That's crazy. Then if you look up here, chocolate cake, celebration cake. Again, coppers, and that's 4,669 gold. Two of them. Insane. People just throw money away in this game, and I'm here to catch it all. So, uh, so that's pretty much it there. Another enchant breacher is superior versatility. Like I said, I definitely uh, focused on my enchanting right now. So that's where I'm making a lot of my money. Uh, let's see. 3588000 That's where we're at. So let's collect that auctions. Um, I'm going to finish up my enchanting within the next day. So I should be fully stocked on enchanting. Then I want to do a little bit of blacksmithing, I think, and a little bit of leather working. And that's really the only professions I, I do. Um, I could do a little bit of alchemy, but... I don't really have a lot of patterns in that to really make it worthwhile. Uh, I am going to start trying to get the, um, what is that stupid thing? The alchemy mount. Uh, I can't think of it at the moment. Uh, Vial of the Sands. I'm going to continue to go back to working on that. Uh, it might hurt me a little bit trying to make money, but I definitely want to get that pattern because it's, I think it sells in my realm for 50, 55,000. So let's see where that gets us. Uh, second 50 auctions is 70,000, so that puts us at like what 170, 180,000 for the day so far. Uh, let's see, nothing really big here. A couple thousand, uh, sun scale spoiler for 4,900, enchant chest for 2,700, ravengers 28, 
Uh, Beacon of Hope, 44. Uh, Dark Iron Rebirth Crafted, 23,000. Uh, Double Link Tunic, 8,900. Lofty Arm Guards, 2,700. Uh, Vanguard Sabatons, 5,000. And Sunskill Helmet for 1,000. Again, uh, nothing too crazy, but it all adds up in the end. So that's another 70,000. So that's really good. Uh, let's see. <laughs> uh, let's see. We'll wait the six seconds and see where it gets us. Uh, about six minutes. So I really can't imagine the next 34. It's very good, but you never really know. Um, I did have a question for you guys. I'll see how you see how you feel about this. Uh, I was watching a video on Wants to Buy Gold the other day, and he wanted to do $5 million or $5 million gold in a month. And I was interested to see how he was going to do this. And what he did was he did it by multi-boxing eight characters at once. And he says it's completely fine because it's not considered botting and Blizzard doesn't really care about it, and it's been fine since day one. But to me, I don't know. I mean, it seems a little seems a little shitty and cheaty. Like, I mean, he definitely knows what he's doing, and he, he's been around for a while, and he makes a lot of money, and he knows everything about numbers and stuff like that. But I don't know. I kind of lost a little bit of respect for him if you can just multi bot eight characters in one shot because he was saying something that um, it would take him three hours to get one of. He can get potentially three or four in a half an hour, and... I don't know, I feel that that takes away. I mean, I get what he's trying to do, and I guess he's trying to make a lot of money, but to me it takes a lot of it away. So uh, what do you guys think? Leave a comment and down below, and uh, we'll talk about it. All right, the last 34 auctions is 74,000 gold, more than I thought it would be. Uh, the Shoveler from Aldemain for 19,000 gold. Uh, let's see. Uh, recipe transmute earth to life for 30,000 gold. That's pretty crazy. Uh, three of warlords, 2,500. Plans of the frost gar. That's super easy to get. You buy for not much, a couple hundred gold. Uh, it's 2,000 gold. Three of warlords again for 2,500 gold. And that's about it. And this is how long I've had shit in the auction house now, or a mailbox, because I just haven't really played. That's expiring in three days, so. All right, so that's another 70. So that's what, 240 some thousand gold roughly this week? 250,000 gold? I mean, it's not really this week. It's over the last couple of weeks. So I don't want to lie to you guys and tell you it's not. But all right, we'll collect that. So yeah, that's my plan. Definitely build up your professions. I think that's key. Uh, work on all the professions you can. The more you get, the more auctions you can have. The higher, more amount of auctions you have, the more sales you will get. Um, I'm definitely going to try and do some open world dungeons, or open world raids, sorry, uh, like farms, I don't want to keep saying raids, but open world farms, uh, I think I want to do a little timeless isle, try and build up some of that stock too, um, and that's about it, I mean, I'm definitely just getting back into the whole gold farming thing, I lost my way for a little bit with this whole classic, but I think I'm back. I have the fever going to make a lot of gold. I definitely want to make a lot of gold. And at the end of the day, I still want to get that Brutusaur amount for $5 million, So that's really my overall goal. But I would love to see how long we can keep this going. Make it fruitful. Make it interesting for you guys. Hopefully you guys eventually leave some comments and tell me what you guys want to do. Want to farm. Uh, a lot of the people I used to farm with now are just classic now only, I feel. So if you guys want to jump in, do you want to guys want to help farm? Uh, battle tags in the comments. Please hit me up. We'll get some farms going. We'll all make some money and it'll be great. All right. If you like the video, hit the subscribe button, share, leave a comment, and I'll talk to you guys next time.